If you're struggling with indigestion, constipation, or worries about body fat, warm water could be your secret weapon. Beyond these benefits, warm water can also help break down fats that might accumulate on blood vessel walls, potentially preventing atherosclerotic plaques. It aids in detoxifying your body, eliminating toxins, and fighting off infections. Please stay tuned as this video also discusses the benefits of drinking warm water throughout the day and the viewpoint of Eastern medicine on the matter. A lot of us begin our days with a cup of strong coffee or hot tea for breakfast. While these beverages certainly help us wake up and get motivated for the day, it's questionable if this is the healthiest way to begin the morning because staying hydrated and consuming enough fluids are essential for good health. In order to promote metabolism and digestion, health-conscious people frequently begin their days with a glass of simple water. However, did you know that the temperature of the water you drink also affects its benefits? In this video, we'll discuss the advantages of drinking warm water, the health benefits of warm water as understood by Eastern medicine. The concept of the health benefits of warm water originated in China, influenced by their gistic philosophy of yin and yang. According to Chinese medicine, drinking cold water upsets the body's yin and yang balance. The ideal temperature of water is 37 degrees sax. If a person is ill, it is advised to drink hot water to restore balance. It is typically not recommended to drink cold water because the stomach uses energy provided by the kidneys to warm the water, which is a waste of kidney energy. Instead, Warm water is better for overall health even if it may not taste as good as cold water and is more difficult to drink, therefore one should begin with a little sip or two and work their way up to a larger amount each day. It is important to drink warm water on an empty stomach to prevent it from combining with food and digestive enzymes since it enters the intestines fast and doesn't need to be heated or digested in the stomach. This type of water is also called quick because it passes through the stomach quickly. Other liquids, such as fruit drinks, jellies, or composts, need to be partially processed by enzymes in order to break down complex ingredients into simpler ones. Warm water, on the other hand, does not strain the body and is quickly absorbed. Warm water raises body temperature and starts metabolic activities, which speeds up metabolism considerably. This is especially true when combined with lemon or ginger, which are also sources of healthy nutrients that aid in digestion. It is commonly known that drinking a glass of pure water in the morning also speeds up the metabolic process. Warm water helps with digestion and relieves constipation by softening stool and promoting easy passage through the body. In contrast to cold water, which can impede the removal of lipids, warm water encourages the production of digestive enzymes, which are necessary for properly processing meals. It also aids in the cleansing of the intestines of toxins and waste products. Warm water aids in the breakdown of fats, facilitating their evacuation. Otherwise, fats may build up on blood vessel walls and result in atherosclerotic plaques. To support the digestive system and the absorption of nutrients that normalize bowel function, it is beneficial to drink this water before and after meals. Inadequate fluid intake slows down the movement of stool through the intestines, which can cause constipation and abdominal pain. To prevent this, it is important to regularly drink at least 2 liters of water daily. Warm water's advantages are especially remarkable. Warm water facilitates the movement of intestinal contents increases intestinal motility, and removes toxins from the body. This kind of water helps the body to free itself of harmful substances by encouraging the movement of waste through the intestinal tract and boosting the activity of the kidneys and liver, which are responsible for filtering toxins out of the blood and removing them through urine to keep the urinary tract functioning normally. It's critical to consistently consume enough liquids. Using warm water removes the symptoms of cold and accelerates the body's removal of viruses, which is why drinking lots of fluids is advised when suffering from a cold. It's ideal for a dry cough, particularly when honey or lemon is added. In contrast to cough drugs, warm water also frequently lowers edema in the respiratory tract and nasopharynx more efficiently than cough medications do. 
there are no major adverse effects or contraindications to using warm water. Drinking a lot of fluids is important while suffering from urinary system diseases like cystitis, which is an infection of the bladder's mucous membrane. This helps remove dangerous bacteria from the organ and reduces symptoms. Warm water with cranberries or lemon is especially useful. This beverage produces an acidic environment that makes infectious agents unattractive and ultimately causes their demise. Warm water helps in relaxing smooth muscles of internal organs and eradicating spasms. This medication is beneficial for headaches brought on by constricted blood vessels or menstruation pains brought on by spasms in the uterus. It enhances skin condition by removing toxins from the blood vessels and intestines, which indirectly purifies your skin. A buildup of toxins in the body is often the cause of skin eruptions and flakiness. Warm water drinking on a daily basis promotes clear, smooth, and acne-free skin. Most people need between 1 and 2 liters of water each day at the very least, with warm water being more advantageous and effective. Using warm water improves blood supply to all organs and tissues, prolonging youthfulness. Warm water is an excellent way to maintain the life cycle of cells in various tissues and organs. Since ancient times, healers and physicians have known that dehydration results from a lack of fluid in the body. This is especially true for older adults, as the amount of water in tissue decreases significantly with age. Therefore, it is crucial to consume enough water on a regular basis. Thick blood can result in migraines, raise the risk of thrombosis, and cause other issues. Regularly drinking one glass or more of warm water each day will help prevent such effects by encouraging the kidneys and intestines to get rid of toxins and free radicals, which can damage healthy cells. Furthermore, enough moisture helps to tone and hydrate facial skin while reducing flakiness and wrinkles. A glass of water can help you from getting the flu. Consuming fluids on a daily basis helps your immune system function better. Warm water promotes healthy blood circulation and stimulates the lymphatic system. These two processes help the body to fight off viruses that cause the flu and the common cold. Why should you drink warm water all day long for a complete effect? It is advised to drink warm water not only in the morning and evening, but all day long as it increases metabolism and gets your body ready for the day. This process is especially important for people trying to lose weight. Keeping the water balance increases immunity, normalizes blood pressure, and nourishes and moisturizes your skin to minimize wrinkles and unsightly flakiness. Having a glass of water before bed helps you sleep better and fall asleep more easily. Warm water has almost no side effects, in contrast to many products that have a wide range of contraindications. However, there are some conditions where precaution is required in drinking too much water. If you have chronic kidney disease, which is characterized by high blood pressure and edema, it's best to speak with your doctor about how much fluid is appropriate for you. Avoid putting honey, lemon, or ginger in water if you have an allergy to these materials to avoid adverse reactions. Warm water promotes bile secretion, which can result in stone movement and discomfort. Therefore, people with gallbladder stones should watch how much fluid they drink. People who have arterial hypertension should exercise caution when their pancreatitis or gastritis flares up. Warm water consumption should be kept to a minimum throughout the summer or hot weather. If you are prone to acute colitis or inflammation of the gallbladder, limit your consumption of warm water as it may exacerbate pain. This is especially important if you have renal or heart vascular disorders. Before taking warm water, find out the recommended volume from your doctor. As we bid farewell, I want to leave you with this thought. Every sip of warm water is a step towards a healthier, happier you. So, whether you're starting your day with a glass of warmth or winding down in the evening, let it be a moment of self-care and nourishment. Embrace the journey towards wellness, knowing that each small choice adds up to significant change. Thank you for joining us today. And remember, your health is your greatest asset. Until next time, keep sipping, keep smiling, and keep shining. Wishing you a hydrated and vibrant life.